Hello, this is Kay Pisces from kpisces.com and I'm here with Pisces November 2014 Love Edition Love Scope. Let's do it. Look, I don't even know. I, I haven't even thought about it before I got on here, so I haven't been thinking about what's going to happen this month with me or anything. So, we'll see. I can't even imagine. Oh, Lord. Tug of war. Tug of war are the words that I am feeling as far as love this month. Perfect. It's just what we need. Some more. What? I feel like Pisces could be trying to pull away from somebody and it's not happening. <laughs> oh lord. Can't breathe. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, the first card I pulled was a Knight of Swords reversed. Got the Four of Wands. I have the Ten of Swords here and the Six of Cups reversed. Now what I'm feeling right now about this is that there may be a relationship or a person that you were feeling like it was time to break away from. Okay? Time to break away from them. Because you're so dead on the situation. You know what I'm saying? It's just like... Really? And because a lot of harsh words between you two. Um... It looks like you may be getting a surprise or it's going to be some kind of celebration between you two, even though you're feeling kind of like, mm, eh, I really don't want to deal with this person anymore. Or I'm really just, you know, done with um, everything that has happened. And it's just like so many things have happened between you two. And it's just like, can it even be, it's, it's so dead that it can't even be repaired. You know, that's how you're feeling. Like, this is it. Like, I can't anymore. You know, like, this is the, this is the death of it. Um, these two, for me, you know, it's a lot of bad words going between you. A lot of uh, bickering and arguing. And it's just like, I think you feel like you said all you can say. You felt all the emotion that you can feel about it. And it's just like, man, fuck it. You know, like, I'm throwing in the towel. It's almost like you are giving up because you feel like it's not like you're giving up it's more like I've done everything that could possibly be done so now fuck it like I did it all I could do and it didn't work so fuck it right looks like that person is not gonna let you oh they're gonna be waiting around waiting on you to see what's, what's gonna happen They might put some attention on it, you know, because they, I feel like they're not going to want you to go. You know what I mean? not going to want you to leave the situation. They might even um, offer to start over again or might try to stage a new start between you two. Okay. Another one. This person has 100% got on your bad side. Like, but you feel like, is it a trick? Is it fake? Is it real? Is this, should I believe this? You know what I mean? Because you know they've made bad decisions in the past. You know what I'm saying? And they have to come through for you. You know what I mean? And, and it's just like, you know, you feel the regret. And it's like all this fighting and shit, I'm over it. You know? Outcome. It may start over. You might decide this is... But it will be starting over maybe from fucking day one is where you have to go to make the situation work because it seems like it's just, it, it, to me, what I see is like, you know, a road full of shit, like full of, okay, do I make a Walking Dead reference? Yeah, I'm about to. Okay, so you're in 
it's like you're on the highway and all these cars are stopped. There's nobody in them. There's nowhere to go. You can't move the car away. You just have to get out and go around them. You know what I mean? So you have to get out and go around these obstacles that are in your way if you want to be in the situation again, if you want to deal with this person again. I feel like it's just, it feels like the road in front of you is so cluttered with all your old shit that it's just like you're not sure if you want to do it. You know what I mean? So you know the only way you can do it is if you start from the beginning and try to make a new start and we'll see how that goes okay it, we'll see how it goes I mean it, it, okay this is horrible because the tower comes next and the tower is telling me that maybe suddenly you'll decide that this ain't gonna work or maybe suddenly you decide okay I'll go ahead and give this shit a chance you know, because it looks like it's not going to end the way you think it is because judgment's reversed. So it looks like we're just going to be dragged along this month with this person who doesn't want us to go. Oh, but then the star. Whoop-de-doo, yippee. The star comes. And this, even the star is reversed, it's still good reversed. You know what I mean? Because it's telling you. Okay. What I, the analogy that I give for everything in the world, I always give analogies because I love them so much. A step for a send it. Anyway, the analogy that I give for the star or the sun being reversed is like, woohoo, I hit the lottery, but I gotta pay taxes. But I still won. You know what I mean? It's like happiness and contentment without the shine. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, woohoo. But, so maybe what that means is that you're going to be, um, Feeling so like, okay, well, this person has laid everything out on the table, everything's together, or it could be you deciding you want to be with somebody and you lay it on the table and everything is, you know, copacetic, but you're still kind of thinking about that old shit, which you should keep in mind, you know, and if you see any red flags, by all mean, flag on the mother, play, throw that flag out, throw that flag out. If you see something wrong, if you get one inkling of a problem, child, if if you the first time you see this person going back into old person trust it trust that okay and some of you Pisces may have gotten yourself into a situation that you feel you fucked up by something you said okay by something you said you think you fucked up you might have thought you changed things but I don't think it's really over I feel like uh, maybe you accidentally saying some shit that you shouldn't have said may have put things on another level it may have made things better or could have made them worse but when it comes out the way things work out it's gonna work out fine the way it's gonna come out because the star is here so either way if you accidentally said some things that you shouldn't have said to somebody or you end up telling something that you shouldn't have said or or somebody said something to you they shouldn't have said maybe it's going to smooth over maybe we're going to forget about it or maybe the other person's seeing if you're going to come back or it could be you you know um deciding that you're going to go ahead and give peace a chance whoo k pisces from kpisces.com you can check me out for super detailed reading because I am the tell all reader I tell it all I don't hold nothing back ain't no secrets ain't no nothing you want to know about just a baby cousin uncle you know cousin day day and Craig I'll tell you all about them too because that's just what I do anyway hit me up on the website guys and I'll 